On Friday, May 8th, 2020, East Chicago Central teachers, along with EC volunteers, including some members of the East Chicago Common Council, aided in the delivery and posting of signs and posters for EC Central senior graduates for the class of 2020. And today I'm here with a lot of teachers and a lot of volunteers who are going out to help us put um, signs for our seniors because we wanted to make sure to represent our seniors. Yes, I know it took long, but see, we had to do things the easy way and make it personable. Every sign has their name on there. The athletic department also giving out banners to spring sports. Um, again, this is an effort that's done by a whole committee. No one's bigger than the other person. We all are working together to get things done. Thank you to everyone who has supported our seniors, who has supported our teachers, the administration um, through this pandemic. And, you know, keep on adopting, keep on moving for our seniors. Um, May 28th, if you're out there, uh, make sure you use, uh, decorate your house because there's going to be a parade going around. From East Chicago Central High School, four buses then deployed to different districts to cover ground, making sure everyone was serviced and celebrated. several of our staff members who are here to take approximately seven buses to go deliver personal signs uh, to our seniors. This is just one of the tokens that we're going to use to let our seniors know that we care about them. So each student will receive a uh, yard sign that has been personalized with their names. So we have several uh, staff members and we have approximately five buses that will be delivering our signs to our great uh, seniors, the class of 2020. Thank you and stay safe. Robert Garcia, I'm Director of Transportation. We're out here this morning to uh, deliver signs for our seniors. Uh, we're ready to go. It's a nice, frisk day, but we're ready to go and uh, surprise our seniors for today. Order of the streets, which is how they should all be, but we're okay. What we're going to do is one person on each bus is going to tell me what name we're on and what address. Then the other person is going to find the sign Someone else is going to stick the seat, the sign in when we get there. There's also a phone number. We're going to try to call each kid before we arrive so they know we're coming. Okay, I also would like it if we could do a big group picture. And I would also like it to be, even though we'll probably be tired towards the end, a big celebration every time we stop. Honking the horn, cheering, everything like that. High energy, thumbs up, everybody good? Yeah. All right, can we also, do we want to designate one person to jump out so everyone on the bus isn't jumping out? Or we could take turns. I love that idea, take turns. All right, any questions? No. Let's do this, yay! <laughs> EC proud, I can't even imagine how great everyone is rallying behind our kids. We love you, class of 2020, and this is our pre-delivery state, and we're gonna get them all out, and East Chicago strong, EC pride, respect EC. EC! <laughs> 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 
The challenge of delivering to every student listed proved difficult as some of the graduates were either away from their residency at the time, relocated altogether, or were unable to be reached by cell phone. To the rest of the dedicated teachers like Mr. Lane and even the dedicated superintendent Ms. Dietta Wright and the volunteering personnel, they did not falter and saw the positive and fun side of the entire operation.